Okay, good morning. Uh, hopefully, every we should be able to. We should be up and about. I'm a little bit early this morning, but I just wanted to um, crack on with the project I was doing last night. And one thing I've done is I've left, left my hot drink over the other side of the room. I'll be back. There we go. All nicely settled in now. Uh, okay, right. Where are we? Let's have a look. Got everything up and going. I've not done a massive amount of messages this morning. Just posted on Discord that I've gone live. Hopefully it's not that many other people online this morning. Sort of streaming at this time of day. Might get the, uh, the odd Minecraft person come in and check me out. Check out the live stream, guys. What's going on? Here we go. Oh, we're exactly where we left off last night. Fantastic. Oh. The pretty cats. Okay, and there's one up there, which is interesting, because I'm not sure how you're going to get down. Uh, are you dog? I think dog's over there. Okay, so what we were doing was getting some spacing here. That's definitely low enough. Now, I want eight. Mm, or is it nine? So I think that is there, if I'm right. Yep, that's that one. Let's have a look. So, one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, yeah, I might take. Hmm. I'm sure the space around it. Could be that I need to actually make a set of stairs a bit further away, or an access a bit further away over there. Um, yeah, let's look at doing that first. I've got this tunnel area that I can expand, even though it's a dead end. And then move a path back up over there. Ah, oh, that's that path there. That's good. Okay. So let's make this room bigger than it needs to be. Um, have I got any scaffolding on me? I don't, but I do have... Um, some wood here that I can do some bits with. I'm just getting a message that I just need to check. No. I do like the sound of the cats. They sound awesome. Right, I just got to reply to this. Okay, right. That's the lovely Halo messaging me. She's so cute. All right, so I can. Yeah, let's um, let's make a little bit of an area here at the end of these stairs. This access bit here. I'll make this like. This will be good for some space. 
do some bits. So let's start off by getting a crafting table in here. Slightly incapacitated today. I got bitten by a bug on my hand. And um, the little rascal has like left this bite on me and it's right between my fingers. It's just like really itchy and irritating. Seriously irritating. Uh, some spare flint there. Oh, I've got wood here. I can make some ladders. There we go. That'll do perfectly. They can go in there. Let's just get rid of the excess stuff I don't need. That do. I've lost a few tools. Where happened to my fishing bow? I had a fishing rod there somewhere. So, I'm going to make a set of ladders that go down yeah probably about here I think so let's cut that out and this will be some access when I need it to get in and out of the spawner that'll make my life a little bit easier What we'll do is we'll take this wall down here because I think that needs to be a little bit wider. And I think we're going to have a problem with the cat. Because basically, you need to move. There we go. Let's unzip the cat. I've also got my replay mod on today. I'm trying not to um, move the cat. Um, it's uh, being stubborn. Stupid thing. Is it because you're stuck? Is that even a thing? I get you down because I don't want you to die especially after I spent time naming you last night it's really difficult to shift click when um, you don't want to move do you seriously oh you've moved that's good That should stop you doing that. Now, if I can... Shift the cat. Come on. Get back on there. That's it. Come on. Off you go. No, not on the box. Get off the... Sort this out. Don't think cats hurt themselves when they fall, do they? No, don't think you do. That's a bit weird. I could have just shoved you off there and not worried about it. Oh my god, cats in stereo. Clazy little things. Okay, uh, back to the game. Just check. Two of you better behave yourself. I have Dog J and Dog I, I think. The most inefficient way of breaking a block. Um, right, so this will be the water stream going out here. So if I dig a level down here like that. Because I want the skeletons to go out that way. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I need two out of that wall over there. Mm, 
yeah. I'm just going to get the two of you watching me now, aren't I? No. Crazy cats. I also need to be careful that I don't accidentally set the light levels so the spawner kicks off again. What have we got in here? Ah. Oh. Good morning, Loza. Um, yeah, you'll have to not use all caps. <laughs> Twitch will tell you off. I don't think you're trying to uh, spam the chat. <laughs> Good morning and welcome to the Steamcraft server. Basically where me and uh, Halo play. And the uh, the pre-work stream, and my two little uh, noisy friends, who basically get in the way of everything you're doing. Yeah, I mean, I I, I think Halo feels the same sometimes that um, she's working. To be honest, this isn't the best situation for me either. Because, in a, in a strange way, I'd rather be at work. Because that would mean I don't, I don't finish up half five and then have to try and rush home. Tonight we've got plans. And it's just like, takes it out of your day. Whereas I normally used to finish at four. Which was like, uber nice. I think this is showing my skills as a minecrafter just to sort of show that I can actually manage to do this without killing the cats. So you're probably wondering what on earth I'm doing. I don't know if you've ever actually played Minecraft, have you? I don't know if that's something you've done. So what we have in here is a spawner. These are naturally generated in the world and this one generates skeletons and by lighting up the room it stops it from working and the idea is is we're going to make a large space for them to spawn they will then I'll make the room dark they'll spawn and they'll get flushed and prepped so that they're ready to be killed by me and when they die they get lots I get lots of XP which means I can then use the XP to get other advancements in the game. It's all quite cunning. It's all about using the mechanics of the game to get what you can out of it. Yeah. Right, so my water stream is going to go over the back here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I think that's the right distance. Uh, I won't put that until the end. And then what I then need is, how wide did I make this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I did, right. Meow. I think I should get away with a two-way water stream because it's easier for the, uh... yeah, let's do it a bit like this. hoping is that the water streams used to I need to move I'm not quite sure how that's going to work because you're going to get washed away in a minute um, if I put some torches up a little bit higher here like that if I just spam the room with torches then when I put this water stream down hopefully I won't get flooded with Skeletons could go very badly wrong. Let's not use the lava bucket, that's for certain. So I think I want to put one in that corner. The fish are now bobbing. Can I get away with one in that corner? Will that 
Mm, doesn't quite go far enough. I might have to put them on a block. The mechanics of this game is very, very odd. Um, so if I put a block there... No! Oh my god! Cat was slayed by Mon PJ. Oh, thank God for that. At least it wasn't the other cat. Then there was one. I, did, I didn't, didn't mean to do that. Don't look at me like that. I'm not a cat murderer. I don't know what happened. He got, he got in the way. It was an accident. I've got a replay mod on. I can I can prove that I didn't do anything wrong. Don't meow me. You weren't all up there in the way. It wouldn't be a problem, would it? No. I have string from him anyway. Good morning, Becca. Um, I hope you didn't just see that. That was um, scary. Welcome to the stream and say hello to Dog. Dog the cat. Yep. Right. I think that. Perfect. And that one over there. Well done, Puddy Cat. You are now demonstrating the uh, the mechanics of this game. Fantastic. Right, so that should sweep them all over there. Now I need to get. I'm going to need to break these out. Oh, that's stupid. Why are you flowing the wrong way? Let's grab them back. Get the water updates to go in the right direction. Oh, it's because they come down there, isn't it? That's why. Um, no. Run that one. Where does it go down first? Ah, uh, yeah, I see, I see, I see, I see. Yep, okay. That's better. That'll do nicely. There you go, dog. Demonstrate, please, the uh, mechanics of the game. Fantastic job. Very, very good. You're being perfectly aligned to go right down the middle. Look at that. You're a pro. You are. Stop bobbing up and down. See? It's not that hard, is it? Did you like that? Are you nice and clean now? Good. Uh, right, so that definitely works. So we're going to get rid of the water because it's going to be a pain in the bum. Building this with it all in there. Cat's now having a little dance. Happy? No. Didn't think you were. Splendidly. Okay, so we've got that bit. Now we need the item elevator. I'm going to need to go and get some bits. I'm going to have to take you back, feed you some fish or something, and get you out of the way. Because this will be way too dangerous. I need to move that ladder, ladder in as well, because I need to be out of the way of the door. Yeah, because I'm going to want a door here. So, so Becca's being very quiet in chat. I'm guessing that um, you've only just got up or something. I don't know. Hope you're okay this morning. Hello, pretty cat. 
looks good. Uh, I might just stick a couple of torches down here just to stop the light levels going nuts. So in the back corner here, I want a couple of those. And then I'm going to do what you're not supposed to do, which is dig up. I think it's okay here. Uh, that's gone through. Put a door in there. If I could get the cat to teleport up here, that'd be really helpful. Right, so we'll have a item stream coming up here. I'm trying to remember, I think I've got to drop them like 22, haven't I, or something. So that's quite a long way up to take them, to get them to then drop to here. I don't really want to drop them out the back there, because I want to use this area. So, one, two, so where am I going to drop them? Take them up across and then drop them over in this corner. I could drop them like there. Yeah, that would be good. So I need to go up 22 from... That's where I want them to hit the ground. So I want to go. I want to go twenty up, twenty-two up from here, and then build the tunnel across. Uh, let's open the ceiling out a bit. It's a bit low. Can't be working in confined spaces. Are you still down there, Puddy Cat? I'm hoping you'll find a way to teleport up here in a minute. All right, this will be some stairways, and I might make this like an observation area. Just put glass in here, and then we can see in what's going on inside the spawner. Right. So, 22, what have I got? Ladders. I've got five. That's not very helpful, is it? Let's make some more ladders then. Wood and sticks and ladders. There we go, 17. Is that what I need? One, two... Three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine. Wow, that's scary. This is why I put the ladders up. Actually, have I got a... Don't have a shovel. Let's make a shovel. Make a stone shovel. I think I can hear the cat walking around. Lost track now of how many I've done. Well, I had 17 ladders on me, so the ground would be 18. That would be 19, 20, 21, 22. So they've got to drop from that level. That's the ground level, so I need to get two more above it, and then two more like that, to come over that way. 
Yeah. So, scaffolding would have been much easier to build this with. In fact, I think I've got some scaffolding up there, and if I do that, it might actually move the cat as well at the same time. That's a dead end. It was up here. Ah, right, you stay there. Yep, yeah, stay there. Right, let's get the scaffolding because that's much better. String. I'll probably make some more scaffolding. That'll do. That was not made from cat. By any means. Wasn't, wasn't. Not true. You stay there. Go down here, around the corner. Like so. Okay. So this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine blocks across. One. How do you like? Oh my god, how are you supposed to do that? If I just spam click that, then I can climb up it. There we go. It's like a pro, isn't it? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. But hopefully those two spaces there will be what drop us down that there into our lift shaft at some point I should drop a couple of blocks why does this feel like a really long way down That's too far, isn't it? I goof that up. That was pretty silly. leave any spawnable spaces for stuff. Where did I go wrong there? It's in that direction, so that's what, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight and nine. 
That should have worked. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Dig down through eight and nine. What did I do then? Hang on, let's actually face the right way to start with. So it's that way. That'd be why I dug the wrong way. Holes in that direction. God's sake. I am such a donut. I wonder if I couldn't find them. Stupid boy. Uh, right, one, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. My tool's about to break, so I'm going to go and get that fixed. here but I've got an anvil up here that's not the right way it's down here keep my tools fixed hello have we got any iron no we've got no iron cat what's going on here there's no iron well, it wasn't my fault. It's not my fault, is it? Um, uh, I'm going to have to go back and get some. Because there's none around here, is there? Well, not that I've seen. Good morning, Halo. How the devil are you? We have a, we have a, a cat, by the way. And yes, its name is Dog. You do have loads of iron at the base. Yes, you do. I will go and have a look. Because this um, whole experiment was about a... Um... I'm not too bad. My throat feels a bit, like, crusty. My eyes feel like a bit tired. Uh, I think streaming first thing in the morning. As you can see, this is very busy here. Like, have you guys been breeding more more iron golems? Seriously, I do not need that many iron golems. Crazy, absolutely crazy. See, I've got a load of iron in there. That is a lot. I think there must be about 30 of the damn things. Or even more. That cause a bit of lag. So let's have a look. Uh, it's a meeting place. So the villagers have been busy doing their thing with the whole breeding stuff. So we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 30. And that's that without the ones that are around that side as well. There's another one over there. I'll put a load of beds down so we get more villagers. See, there's a few over there as well. Yeah, there's like 30 odd iron golems. It's just absolutely nuts. And there's cats everywhere. And there's butchers and Fletchers and but you won't sell me bows yet. And then there's unemployed people. It's just absolutely crazy over here. It did uh, and there's cows and sheep and we haven't got any pigs, we've got chickens. To be honest, coming over here to the skeleton spawners, the only quiet place. <laughs> 
This scaffolding that they've added in the game is fantastic. It's so cool for getting around on. Makes getting up and down so much easier. Right, so um, that's what I was going to do. I was going to repair this, wasn't I? There we go. Um, is this server private? Yes, it is private. <laughs> um, this is my own server that me and uh, Halo play on. It's um, out there in the cloud to, to be worked on. Oh, I hear skeletons. That means I've probably accidentally spawned some. No. Um, this is what I'd like to try and get some good people to come and join in on play on. So get a bit more of a community going. Hence why I've been calling it the Steamcraft server. What I want is to sort of, a bit like how you see other big communities where they've got like 10 or 12 players. I don't want to put loads and loads of people on, like hundreds so that it's open. I want to keep it private. And then it's sort of a, a bit more fun for just the people that are playing on it then. There we go. Right, so that's going to be the lift shaft. Going all the way up. So we'll take the skeletons up. So the skeletons will go up there. And then they'll get transported across, dropped, and then ready to be killed for their XP. So let's just tidy this up a little bit. That observation bit is obviously going to be in the way now. Uh, so I'm going to have to move that tunnel over a bit. So just fleshing the mechanics of this out at the moment and then I'm going to sort of tidy it up a little bit more. But yeah, one of the other things that I've got to do is get an iron golem farm going. As you can see, it's not that difficult to get them breeding. Not with the new game mechanics. So um, that'll be good. We've got iron for days. Right, so that's the spawn area in there. I'm not worried about... I might tidy up the inside. I'll see how I go. This is sort of like a little observation area. That's going to be the water stream. So that needs to be enclosed there like that. Oh, my throat's rough today. Like... Ugh, choky. I might put some glass there. Just going to put that there for now. I don't think the water will come out. So that's the water stream that'll come over and then the skellies will drop to there. And I might give this a test in a minute. Uh, yeah, I might give this a test. Right, so I'm going to go back and grab the materials from the main base for this. That wrong way. What I need is... I've got water. I need some soul sand. I don't know if I've got any glass or sand around. It's all stuff I can just adapt a bit later on. Right. Oh, I knew that'd happen. I knew I'd come out and there'd be a creeper there. Excuse me. I want to be inside in the safe. Uh, the iron golems walk on the um, <laughs> on the bushes. They take damage, which is quite quite weird, really. I mean, well for me, but the fact of the fact they're made of iron, standing on a bush gives them damage. But, but then this is Minecraft. The most weirdest of things happened, like multi-dimensional portals. Can hardly describe this as like being in the real world, can we? Minecraft physics are weird. 
Um, yeah, so soul sand makes water go up, I believe. I got that right. It goes over there like that. Um, iron, I've got to take some extra iron because I'm going to want some hoppers. And let's take, I think I've got some wood over there, but I'll take some jungle wood with me anyway. Is there any other materials I'm going to need over there? Chests? Probably not. I think that's all I need. Because what I want to do, I'm going to strip this out. I'm going to move it over there to the skelly spawner. And then that will... I better sleep. Stop the phantoms. You can't see that in chat, by the way. That It does not say in chat that a cat was killed. Okay? Did not happen. Not a thing. Someone randomly put that in chat and it was nothing to do with me. Do not want to be known as a cat slayer. And all I, ow! All I'm going to say is I've got the replay mod in my defence switched on. Show that it was a complete accident and nothing to do with me. How am I gonna get oh, I've got to get past him? Walk in the bushes, dude. Really? You're hiding behind the torch. Oh man. Couldn't have done that if I wanted to. Get the XP. Dink. It boot the couch over. <laughs> Guys, seriously. Right. Got rid of the creeper anyway. Hee <laughs> hee. Do do do. Half an hour to go. Then I gotta get ready to go to work. Oops, that was a bit harder landing than I expected. So let's go make a water source down here because that'll be useful as well. Oh, look at all this coal. I, c I can't not dig it up, can I? Really? It'd be a waste. Just leaving it there. water source down here. God, there's loads. When you go looking for it, you can never find it. Well, of course you can find coal, but you know what I mean. Do nicely. Thank you very much. That's where I was going to put the water source. I oh, know, was it? I was going to put it there. Now, I still do the four-way one. Lots of people use like the three block water source, but I like the four block one. It's just me. It's what I like doing. Right, uh, soul sand. Hope I got this the right way around. Yeah, it's magna cube, magna cubes that pour the water down. They're like that. Now I think I've got to put signs here because otherwise the water's going to flow in. Let's do that. Uh, we've got some sticks. We've got some no sticks. Uh, planks. Let's pour them. The 
this appears to be going to be a jungle sign. Where's the, where's the sign thing? Oh, I need more wood. That would help. Not made them so you get different colour planks in this so far. So I know this was something they did where they'd like change the colour of the wood and everything. So we put them there like that. And then because they get flushed down the middle, they'll miss that and then get pushed up the water stream here. The other thing I'll need to do is make that as a solid water stream for the bubbles to work in it. But I should be able to show the principle of this just to start with. There we go. See, we've now got bubbles like that. Now, I could just get loads of buckets of water and slowly fill all this up. But if I remember rightly, if I get some... I think it's kelp. I think if you could put kelp at the bottom and grow it up, then it'll, when you break it, it makes all water source blocks all the way up. But I could just do it with buckets of water. It's not a big deal. That's the thing. Uh, then we need some water up here that will flow across the top. So that water will come up here and then I think you do how you do this so you've got to make it so that they it flows across so the water stream is going to come up there and I can't do water logged these I think I think if I bring the water up to there and then place that one water will then flow across the top so that'd be one two three four five six seven eight Might just need to make it so they push over a little bit further. Not sure. Really need a drink. <clears throat> I probably really don't sound very enthusiastic first thing in the morning, do I? But it is first thing in the morning, guys. Crikey. Okay, right, what's the next thing I want to do? I want to get this water source in. Hmm. I'm thinking the best way to do this. Am I just going to run up and down with loads of buckets? It's going to be really entertaining, isn't it? Not. Hmm. Or should I go and try and find some... If I got... I don't know where there's any kelp. I haven't got any ice anywhere. I'm probably going to have to do this the hard way, aren't I? Now, should I change those blocks out at the bottom for just normal cobble for now so that I can at least swim in the water? I think I will. This could be quite tedious doing it this way. But what I could do is I could just make a water source here and then I could just keep popping down here, couldn't I, for it? Um, yeah, so let's make a freeway wide. That's the easiest thing to do. Do that. Water looks like it's flowing because these bottom two shouldn't be flowing though. 
I've got that right. Could have done with like some swimming apparatus. Successfully, can I do this without? Can I do this without losing any hearts? <laughs> I mean, how can you make a wall of water like that? That's crazy. Of course, the challenge is: is every time I get a little bit higher. Hearts, uh, my bubbles are going to get lower and lower each time. Actually, this isn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. Actually, quite easy. Probably not the most entertaining streaming to watch. Could be good in my replay mod though. I just find Minecraft so funny at times, the whole mechanics of this, when you realise what you're doing. So I've got f a pond of water which I'm filling up with buckets and this never gets emptied. And then I'm swimming in a column of water with a bucket of water to then fill it up higher. And it's like, how is my bucket not full swimming down in the river in a water stream again? It's just <laughs> it's like this game makes no sense at times. It's just completely crazy. I'll wait for my bubbles to come up. It's taking longer to get up there every time now. Nearly at the top. It's getting closer now. I think I'll do one more run and then I might fill the rest from the top. Pressing the control button as well to try and swim faster. Oh, down! Ah! What's happening? Why am I not sinking? Oh no. Oh no. Uh, I'm caught in the wall. Oh no, I'm going to die at the bottom. Pants. Really? <sighs> really? I can't believe it. I can't believe I died in water. God's sake. Really? That's nuts. Right. Paul's not happy. Come on. Speed run for all the mobs. Go and get my stuff back. Can't believe I did that. That teach me for trying to be clever, wasn't it? Oop, oh, creepers. Nothing to see here. There we go. <laughs> I can't believe I did that. I can't believe I drowned in water of all things. Big dog. You got my XP down here? My grave's there. That's going to be the fun thing to get. Oh, 
Oh, look at that, like a pro. Hey! Got my stuff back. Right, let's just resort out my inventory. Bit of a lifesaver, um, having the whole uh, grave mod switched on. I don't know what you think. I really like the Minecraft music. It's just like proper chilling. Right. Uh, let's put the soul sand back in the bottom. like those thank you there we go that's making the bubble elevator and it would appear there's a very angry <laughs> enderman around here somewhere right uh Let's go and fill this from the top now. Stop trying to be too clever. Oh, I can't get in that way, can I? Oh. Right, it's a bit slow. Well, I haven't got to go that far. Well, it's not too bad. Looks like one of those is is moving, doesn't it? Mm. Yeah, one of them didn't fill properly, did it? Uh, so which one is it? Is it that one? Yeah, that one didn't fill properly. Right, okay. many times I've died actually on here. I died quite a few times at the beginning. Not been doing too bad of late. It's normally stuff like that. It's the, sort of the, the dorky silly stuff that I normally end up getting caught on dying. And get this water stream in place. That'd be good. Do that before I go to work. Really don't want to go to work today. It's funny, I'm all right when I wake up and when I first sit down here. But then once I've been here about, you know, 10, 15 minutes, I actually start feeling more sleepy. It's like I could probably like nod off and go to sleep now. Should go back to bed. I'm interested to know, Becca, if you can still hear me. Are you going to uh, consider doing streams in the morning? Hello there, a Spodaroo. Can I get your opinion on my YouTube video? Um, I guess it's a video and you've put it on YouTube. How's that for an opinion? Is that good? You seem to have a little uh, star as well at the beginning of your little uh, snowflake at the beginning of your name. That's good. Yeah, I know. I know. I, was, I thought I was quite clever. Like, look, I've got a YouTube channel as well. I think that's pretty cool. That's what I came for. <laughs> Thank you for the follow. That's fantastic. Welcome to the hub. If you are at all interested, oh, there we go. I'll put that on the screen. I'm fairly new to all of this myself. But there's some links on there to my YouTube, my Twitter, um, my, um, my Discord on there. 
I haven't got my Discord on there. If you just look for Mon PJC, though, you'll be able to find uh, my Discord on there as well. That shouldn't be too big a problem. No stream this morning. I'm currently taking a break until my timetable. Oh, yeah, I know you were uh, going to have a little bit of a break. Uh, any news with the uh, ISP? Any improvements? I'd be interested to know. Because I use uh, Plusnet. And I've always recommended them, to be honest. I've always had a really good time with them. Now, why are the bubbles not coming all the way up here? That means there's a broken block somewhere, doesn't it? it means the bubble elevator is broken somewhere. Yeah. Oh, we're at it again. So somewhere in there, there's a broken block and it looks like it's down the bottom. I've obviously missed one when placing them. Go down and have a look. Get that fixed before I put these water bottles in. Water buckets in the top. Yes, a spudderoo. You are a fellow aspiring YouTuber, I'm guessing. Right, let's go up and see why that is blocking. This is going terribly wrong, isn't it? One hundred subs, well done, mate. Uh, to be honest, I've only got like mm, seventy-eight or something like that. I've really struggled to get past that. A hundred subs is really good. Is it a hundred subs? I think you can get like a, a custom URL now as well you're my 80th oh fantastic that's super duper well you should definitely i don't think you can post links in here i think i turned that off um i'm assuming no that's a thousand is it a thousand what was there you could do a hundred then or am i just like been wishing to get to 100 for so long now that it's just like <laughs> I'm hoping it's going to be more than that um, I have a discord channel as I say have a look at that or send me a tweet with your YouTube channel and I'll be sure to come along and have a look I would be more than interested I know, I'm always running out of videos to watch during the day to be honest what well, I don't going to correct myself i don't watch the videos what i tend to do is sit there and uh, sort of have my videos on and then i sort of listen to them which is a lot of what i do with streams as well i sort of as becca will know i lurk in the background i wonder if this will help me find out where that block is that's busted um, that's a real pain because you can't see it. it. Must be like a water flow thing here somewhere. You can hit the Discord thing and that will tell you where I'm from. Not sure if that's fixing it or have I still got flowing down water here. This is very frustrating. I'm also conscious of the time and that I need to go in a minute and get myself ready to go to work. I completely broken that. Cool, thank you. Uh, more than happy to have a look at what other people are doing. How 
far is that going up now? Is that going up further? I hope so. I'm not going to get in the bubble stream and find out, put it that way. Doing so well. It's probably when I died that I like missed the block. Now I've got this flowing down water. That's frustrating. What about if I just sink slowly here? That's a long way down. That is definitely a long way down there. I think I'm going to have to do the whole kelp trick. Get that growing to sort that out. I think that's the only way I'm going to fix that problem. Which is a bit frustrating. Where have I got kelp? I haven't got any kelp yet. Uh, how long have I got? Five minutes. Let's go and have a look. It's really frustrating. I was doing so well there as well. It's because I got a bit too cocky. Ah! There's a visitor. Are you standing in the sun by any chance, my friend? You don't want to do that. We're going to find another creeper out here, isn't it? Quick scan. Nope. Kelp. Kelp, 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 kelp. I do have a boat here. So I could go for a quick blast along the river. See if I can find some kelp. I can't remember if me and Halo found any when we were out and about looking for some. Because this is river. We haven't actually found the ocean yet. Might be a bit fruitless. Never find stuff when you want to, can you? Yes, yeah, so the whole trick with the kelp is if you grow it at the bottom, then it creates a solid. Um, it grows up through the water, even flowing water. And then if you break the water block, break the kelp once it's grown, then. Out away, Mr. Squid. I remember when squid used to break boats. Um, you break the kelp and it replaces all the blocks of water with water sources. Uh, it, it, I can't drive through the gap. I don't know that I'm going to find any around here, does it? Oh look, there's mine in Halo's boat from last time. It's a dead end around here. Looking a bit dead endish, isn't it? you only get it in oceans oh, it's a pain well that might have to be a off stream thing to do tonight maybe sort myself out fixing that up that is a real pain in the book Okay, so I don't know who's left out there watching me, um, but certainly thank you for the new follow and for the messages in chat. It's been really good. Uh, to Loza, to Halo, to Becca, and uh, to yourself, Mr. Speederoo. I think that's how I say your name. You're there as well. Um, 
it's been really nice having you there in the background even just lurking uh, as you know just having people viewing your channel at this very early stage is all contributing to the world's statistics and helping the channel grow and who knows one day i may be out. i've gone the wrong way have i just got lost really all helps the statistics so thank you very much i am going to be ending my stream now and uh, i'm gonna make myself a cup of coffee to go to work with Oh, that's where I came in, over here, wasn't it? I will do my very best. I am really looking forward to when you start streaming again, Becca. I know you've got loads on the plate, but don't worry about it. Um, your stuff's really good, and I just, you know, really enjoy your content and you contributing and all of the stuff that you do. And uh, it's, it's good. I think it's brilliant that we can all help each other out. I think that's really important as well. And you've been helping Halo out as well. And I know you do loads on Meg's channel as well. So I think it's fantastic that we've got support for each other. And that we're all here helping each other grow. So I am looking forward to whenever you get round to coming back. It'll be fantastic. And hopefully I can get a nice sunset picture there. Look at that. It's almost picturesque, isn't it? Thanks very much, everyone. I've really enjoyed having you all in the stream. And I will see you next time. Uh, what's tomorrow? Friday. Yes, I'll be back here at 7 o'clock tomorrow morning. See you later then. Bye.